Hey guys, the objective for this video is to determine the shear stress and shear flow distribution of an I-beam. So let's have a look at the question here. We've got our UB here, uh, which has a flange uh, width of 90, uh, thickness of flange of 10, thickness of web of 6 millimeters, and a total uh, depth of 179 millimeters. So we've applied a 150 kN uh, shear force to our beam. It's got a second moment of area of 15.3 times 10 to the 6, and we're going to use this information here to determine the shear stress and shear flow distribution. So we're going to actually have to split this up into two um, separate sections. So section one is going to be here. We're going to be just considering um, the area where Y is greater than 79.5 millimeters. And then over here, we're going to be considering the section where Y is less than 79.5 millimeters. So we need to consider these separately and come up with equations for the shear distribution uh, separately for each of these cases. So the first thing um, that we want to do is just write down our shear stress equation. So shear is equal to the shear